All right, yesterday, which was Monday afternoon, we took up several bills on the floor of the House, one of which was a bill to increase teacher pay. The original bill provided for a $500 raise this year and another $500 the next year. Uh, that was amended on the floor. Representative Holland offered an amendment to make that 2000 this year and 2000 the following year for a total of $4,000 uh, altogether after two years. Uh, that amendment passed and was included in the bill. Then the bill was passed and is now going to the Senate. Now, first of all, people should understand that the Senate cannot concur in the bill. The bill is going to conference because it has a reverse repealer in it, which means it takes effect the day after it's repealed. So it's designed to go to conference for further discussion. When he presented the original bill, uh, Representative Bennett, uh, our Chairman of Education, indicated that even though the $500 was in the bill per year, that he expected, certainly hoped, that it would be a higher amount, but the exact amount could not yet be determined. And that is what he said to the House. Uh, now, on the amendment, as I said, the amendment was passed, so now we have a bill that says it will be $4,000. In reality, nothing really much has changed. The vote yesterday, if anything, was an expression of hope, I guess, and maybe an, an expression of appreciation for what maybe we wish we could do. I don't think even Representative Holland uh, and folks that really pushed the amendment believe we can do that, but I think the idea was to indicate a willingness to do as much as we can which frankly is exactly what Representative Bennett said, our Chairman of Education, when he presented the bill. Uh, now what the real number will be, I don't know. Uh, I'm sure, I feel sure, that it will be somewhere between the $500 and the uh, $2,000, which will be for the coming year. So, you know, the, the people do not necessarily always have a big perspective on this. They realize $500 as a raise, well, that's not a huge amount. Nobody would argue that. Uh, however, for every $500, that means $25 million to the state. So if we did what Representative Holland proposed in his amendment, that would require, over the next two years, $200 million. And it's difficult to see anything like that. Our total growth in the budget for this year was a little less than $200 million. So it's, it's not likely that something of that magnitude can or will be done. However, as I said, Representative Bennett said it probably, he's hopeful that it will be higher than the 500 and 500, you know, that um, was originally presented. So that's, you know, that's the process. It's uh, before us. Uh, I think there's a strong willingness in the House to increase teacher pay, but there's also a very strong willingness to increase uh, the pay for state employees generally, especially those that haven't had recent raises. So that has to be done too, and there's a limited amount of money to deal that with. And on top of everything else, $64 million out of the coming year, I mentioned the $200 million or so that we had a roughly new money, meaning revenue growth over last year. 64 million of that is going to have to be designated for PERS. We basically have to prop up PERS to the tune of $64 million. That's an additional employer contribution. And the employer, of course, for state employees is the taxpayer. So the taxpayer is laying out $64 million for PERS. And if we do the teacher pay raise, whatever that will be, it will be millions for that and certain the state employees pay raise. Now, those are things we need to do. No question about it. Things People certainly deserve it. We need to do it. Find a way to do it. But you need to have a perspective. It's not an insignificant amount of money, even the $500 in the original bill. That's a significant amount of money to this total state budget because we have so many teachers. Uh, but I'm confident we'll continue to do what we can to get as much as we can. And I'm actually... Um, cautiously optimistic we're going to have a raise for teachers and other state employees. Uh, that's what I'm hoping for and looking for.